Problem? Been going on for three, four months now, maybe longer. I'll be standing there minding my own business and suddenly there's a camera right in front of me and no one else sees it. Yes, I see. And now, in session, with the audiovisual psychiatrist. Are they perhaps related to real world spy cameras? Red light cameras, for instance. No, they're not hidden. They're standing in the open on tripods like three legged vultures waiting for me to die. What makes you think they want you dead? Maybe they're just curious. Maybe they think you're pretty. Do you think I am pretty? You're not my preferred format. Can we just focus on my problem? It's always about the patient. No one ever wants to discuss my problems. Very well. Where do you see these cameras? They're everywhere. I'll be walking along, minding my own business, and boom, there's a camera. I'll be stepping out of the shower, and right in front of me, there's a camera. I'll be getting food out of the oven, and there's no food, just a camera. You can't eat a camera. Not easily, anyways. This husband of yours. Housemate. He's my housemate. The white-haired one. You said he has a web series. It's not really a series, it's just him ranging at a camera for 10, 15 minutes. It's completely pointless. And there's your answer. What, are you going to suggest that I'm jealous of the Obscure's web show or something? Yes, yes I was. You might be right. It's my professional opinion that you'd like to imagine yourself as a web star. That you have ideas that you want to share with the internet populace at large. So what kind of pills are you going to prescribe? No pills. I'm going to suggest you create your own web show and review things just as your grandfather does. Housemate. He's my housemate. Oh god, there's a camera right in front of me. Uh, yes, and what kind of camera is it? I think it's one of those old Super 8s. Great, Scott Adams, it's worse than I thought. Is that bad? The more outdated the format, the worse your mental state is. Trust me, I should know. I'm a VHS tape. I drink my own urine for breakfast. I didn't want to know that. I keep fountain pens in my urethra. You are insane. Of course I'm insane! Does a sane person walk around with a VHS strapped to their face? I can't even see what I'm writing! What does he say? What does he say? Well, thanks for the advice, Doctor. I'm gonna take your suggestion and go home, start a web series, and not be murdered here. Bye! Oh. Would you like to schedule your next session? No! It is a hard life being obsolete. The audiovisual psychiatrist coming this fall to ABC. Hey, check it out! I've got a new bit. I'm dancing with my shelf, and I'm dancing. That with is my shelf. so stupid, and it's been done. Yeah, you're a spoil sport. That was your session with the psychiatrist. Why did you dig up that lecherous psychopath? Really? Because I think he's brilliant. He's inspired a lot of my life choices. What are you drinking? It's apple cider and totally not urine. Uh-huh. Well, I need to borrow your camera. As unstable as that tape head was, he did have a good solution. I need to put on my own web show. Can I help? I can do this. All by my shelf. You can, you can, you can, you can, you can, you can run the camera. No talking, no singing. Now meet me in an hour. I'm going to write a script really fast. Scripts? He is scripts. What a noob. Oh, wait, before you go. Watch this. I hurt my shelf today just to see if it still feels. Now go fuck your shelf. Oh, that's a good one. I'm going to write that down. Where's my pen? Oh yeah.